What up, gang? This your boy Young Trey Boomin back with another beat tutorial, and this time I'm gonna be making guitar melodies. I'm gonna show the process of how I like go about on doing my guitar melodies. So I finna go ahead and get started. And y'all, make sure y'all like, subscribe, comment, and let me know what y'all think about this beat tour. They will really help me out and help everyone else out. We finna go ahead and get started. So what I like to do is go ahead and use like a piano. And what piano I'm using is 88. I like this plug and it's pretty good. It probably ain't nothing like uh Keyscape. I can't afford that one right now. But uh sometimes I use Unisphere. I bought that and it's pretty good. But my next step is to get Keyscape to replace this plug in. So now what I feel to do is uh pull up a MIDI scale. It can be any MIDI scale that sounds nice that you used to. But really, it can be any one. So I'm gonna go ahead and just slide that F, F with the F sharp major up into this um, channel rack and go to my piano and go ahead and make a melody. So now I got the MIDI scale inserted. I'm fixing to go ahead and start making a melody and see what we can come up with. So I'm gonna use that and with your guitars you want it to be kind of simple then and this chord kind of change it up like probably that Okay, it sounds good, but now I need to go and match this with the, with the metronome. Okay, that right does sound pretty decent. So what I'm gonna do is now make some bass notes. Shift down and make another layer. I'm a, I forgot one note. Bring this down. Bring this one down too. What I'm gonna do is lower these notes like that. Hit strum. Randomize these notes. Just like that, it sounds way better. So what I'm gonna do. Uh, copy this pattern. Well, now I can mute my my uh, uh keyboard. Okay, now it's pitched up kind of high, so I'ma lower it one octave. That sounds pretty good, and. I can take it up a couple of notes, so I'm gonna just hit shift and hit the up arrow a couple of times. That sound pretty good, so what I'm gonna do is go back and get rid of these chords right here. Move these notes down to where they all line up. There you go. And next. I can add some more notes. I'll put a note right here. A note right here. Just kind of let it build up. pretty good you can add some more notes to this if you want to 
pretty good i can make a beat over there so this this dope so let's try another one so if we just click anywhere it'll be my first note play with the metronome sound pretty good it's the same process as the first one I uh, just showed y'all it's pretty easy and simple so I feel do a strong these notes again by hitting Alt Shift and hitting Alt R. So randomize these notes, bring them down a little bit, then go back, hit Control C, copy, then hit Control V to paste it. And let's see what that sound like. pretty dope That does sound pretty good. I like that. So that's that's another one. We just came up with this chord progression right here by just only using this right here to come up with the chords. This will sound like this. Then this one sound like this. It's simple, it's real simple. Like you don't have to go crazy. But my next one, I'ma just kinda do like something with a band smell of this, you know what I'm saying, with the guitar. And so now for the start on um, E.
what I can do now is uh get these longer notes, bring them back. No up. Just like this. Then come back to the back of these right here. I'm just really playing about ear. Making sure it sounds good. pretty dope same process same process this this, this is my process right here y'all can take it and use it and always come out good everyone has their own like unique style of creating their melodies normally I always come out the same way play it and see what it sound like It's gonna be like that. y'all y'all like subscribe comment let me know how i did on this little beat tour on showing y'all how to make guitar melodies and that's it y'all i'll see y'all next time